here we are with another Risk of Rain run. This time playing the. This time playing the uh, the Commando. Who I played a lot of because it took me a long time to get the Huntress. So I played a lot of Commando. So we'll see how I do. The one thing I dislike about him is how this pushes him back because when you're trying to kill them like when they're on ledges like that can be kind of difficult. And he does it, and you have to actually face your enemies. So it'll take a little getting used to. This is recorded directly after the Huntress run. So. It'll take me a little getting used to. But we'll be okay. We'll be okay. And barbed wire. Not bad. I actually realized I didn't go over the abilities. Um. So this ability is like a double tap. I believe it does 2 times 60% damage. Um, this is a forward roll. I don't think you can be hit while you're rolling. Um, this is like a long range shot. And this is a like a flurry of bullets. They all do a lot of damage. I mean, not right now, of course. But you, you know what I mean. All right, where's the teleporter? Where's the teleporter? Where's the teleporter? There's a chest right there. Yeah, I find in this game I really like the characters that have a mobility uh, ability. Wow, another barbed wire. So people standing next to us are taking a lot of damage right now. <laughs> uh, items up there. Yeah, I'm going to be really mad if, like, the teleporter's all the way on the other side of the, uh, like, all the way on the other side of the map. Oh my god, it's going, it's gonna be. Uh. If you're wondering why I sound so upset, go watch the Huntress run, and, uh, see why I'm so upset. I did say this was being recorded directly after, I believe. Wow. They do a lot of more. Yeah, you're immune while you're uh, while you're rolling. I guess we'll have to go back for some of those items. Those look like some good items. Rusty blades, really good on commando, especially because you double tap all your shots. It's good on hunters, even better on commando. Ah, the wandering vagrant. All right, so a different boss at least. Um. These, this guy just kind of like follows you everywhere and is really annoying, but if he doesn't actually hurt you by like you touching him, he hurts you by hitting you with those balls, so don't get hit by the balls. It's great advice, I guess. Just keep away from the balls. In fact, it would probably even be helpful for me to stand, like, near him Ow. while he's trying to do this. Mm -hmm. Yeah, he fires in two directions if people are, uh, like, really close to him when you use the, uh, the flurry. Ugh. Okay, that's two of those dead. They're really the annoying ones right now, the small vagrants, not the, not the actual wandering vagrant. He's not the difficult one, he's not the annoying one. There is a drone right there. I wonder if I want it. oh, I'm firing the wrong way. God, so he's playing Huntress. I wonder if I want a drone after what happened last time. It's not as easy as I thought it would be. Ow, you... God, I hate you! Leave me alone. Oh, that's good. Move fast out of combat. So that's actually going to let us, in a weird sense, run really fast over to uh, to the items. Wee. Wee. Uh, 
Hmm. Shut up. I want a random item. Gasoline. Not bad. Okay. Here we go. We're going. We're running. We're super fast. Do 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 do. Please tell me there's a rope to get up there. Son of a. You know, what? give me the good item. Give me a good item. That's not bad. Okay. Oh my god, I hate the wisps. I really do. Oh my god, a wisp being there is like exactly what I didn't want. Give me a drone. Okay, up here doesn't look so bad. One wisp. Whoopsies. Oh ho ho! And you get all that gasoline when you kill them all like that too. Oh, there's a chainsaw up there. I want that. Chainsaw's a really good item. Really good use item. I th in my opinion, one of the best in the game. Oh, excuse me, it's a saw meringue. Buy that. Hey, we got the rusty blade. I think we had two opportunities to buy that. And the head stompers. Which is an interesting item. You hurt enemies by falling on them. I'm pretty sure it removes your falling damage, but it's kind of a weird item. You're not really in a situation where you can physically fall on enemies to do a lot of damage, so... It's not bad. Um, but there's better, in my opinion. But it was only 17 gold, so I'm not going to complain. Is the teleporter over here? Do, 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 No, oh, uh, no, you still have fall damage. So I guess you just now deal damage to enemies. Ugh, I hate these things. Get me out of there. I mean, they're going to follow me, but get me out of there. I want to get a big group of enemies to show off the, uh, Sawmerang, because it's a really good item. Don't punch me! God, it's so weird to go from moving so fast to moving so slow when I, uh, go in and out of combat. There's the teleporter. And we get a big line of enemies. Oh, I can't go up there. Whoopsies. What I have to remember when doing this is that the, uh... The Sawmerang fires in the uh, direction you're facing. Ugh. <laughs> okay. More enemies are gonna show up. Okay. Uh, okay. It's gonna gonna be a good time to use it soon. Boom. Lots of damage, as you can see. And it comes back and hits on the way back, so... Really, really good. Uh, I will take this. Because this heals after kills, which is very good. See? Heal, 10 health. Oh, game got harder. Oh, you broke my drone, you jerk. Oh, I, I activated both of those, but the bundle of fireworks is a good item, so I'm not going to complain. My drone is already damaged. That's great. And the Sawmerang applies a bleed, so that's helpful, too. Okay. Um, the Ancient Wisp is still up here. Give 
give me that health that I desperately need. I think I could actually let the drone take care of this guy if I really wanted to sit here and wait. I believe you don't take damage from that ability if you're in the air. So, it's pretty good in that respect. Mm -hmm. Don't die. Yeah, that fireworks, those fireworks, lots of damage. Hmm. How do I want to approach this? There we go. Summerang. We can use fireworks there. It does a lot of damage. Anything that's usable. Anything that you push A on, basically, will light the fireworks. And it's really helpful. And if you get two fireworks, oh my god, the amount of fireworks you shoot out. We still haven't gotten my favorite item yet, though. So, that, that's not fun. You want to kill things as fast as possible because the ice thing stacks. You'll get more and more ice uh, icicles, I guess, you call them, as time goes on, basically. Oh my god, my drone's gonna break again. God, I hate this game sometimes. Actually, I know exactly what I'm gonna do. Hmm, I wonder whatever... Okay, drone, you can stop. Uh, I wonder whatever what I do, standing right here without a way to kill them. Wow. <laughs> so, we're going f pretty much at the same time pace as uh, the Huntress run. I think we finished this level at around 12 minutes as well. Sunken Tombs, this isn't a bad level. This is actually a pretty good level. Good running spots. A lot of flat land. 143. I'm waiting for some enemies, because there can be some fireworks lit off here, baby. There we go. I need some moolah. Alright. Do, 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 do. Where are my enemies? Here we go. It's an elite mob, little tougher. I have faith that that will kill everyone over there. And I was right, so go me. And now I have a lot of money, so... You know, that guy thinks he's safe, that he jumped down there. Chances are, after I kill everyone, he'll be getting hit with some fireworks. So just for fun, fireworks! And I even got something out of it. Go me. With fireworks! Mm, I don't really like that. I think that like stops time, maybe, but I just prefer the damage, so we're gonna stick with that. But fireworks, and that all they all hit that guy that was standing right on top of the chest. You see how much damage it does right there. Dealing damage heals you, that's what I like. Fireworks, I don't even care that it didn't give me anything. It's dealing damage. Well, that one didn't, but 
most of them dealt damage. And he is just getting hit. And you know, it doesn't even really matter that he's doing damage to me because I'm leeching health back. I mean, it's not health equal to the damage that he's dealing, but health is health in my opinion. And especially that flurry of bullets, it gives me so much health back. And we're doing 26 damage per second for people that are near us because we have two thorns. We're in pretty good shape. Activate the teleporter. Maybe something cool down here. Oh, you spawned down here because I was down here. Jeez, you just threw yourself off a cliff. Good job. Oh, these light off fireworks. Fireworks! So I didn't get the item from killing him, but um, he, he threw himself off cliff, so. Actually, I'm surprised he didn't, like, respawn. Because when you fall off a cliff, it just respawns you. You'd almost think it would respawn the boss. But I don't see a health bar, so I have to assume that he wasn't respawned. Fireworks! That's a pretty good item. I would like to have it, please. Thank you. And there are a ton of guys down there. if it hits both ways, but oh my god, and those enemies dying it's so slow, but it gave me the ice I might not die oh god, those missiles god, those missiles gotta be careful oh boy oh, leave me alone Dash. Fireworks. Uh. Somerang. Fireworks. Okay. That sort of worked. Okay. Alright. Okay. We're good. We're fine. We're A-okay. We're fantastic. There's guys down here. Gotta kill them. Look at that. Look at this healing. Uh oh, oh. I tried to open the chest. So this is going to bring us back to the top of the level. Okay, game. I know you're getting harder. It's what you do. Fireworks! Yeah, see, that's that's the damage it does on an elite, so it does pretty good damage on the normals. He's dead. But now, since I'm down here, I gotta run all the way back. But I will get that item. I mean, at the very least, I have the whip, so. Do 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 do. You people can't see it, but my screen just got slightly orange because I have flux. And it's that time of night. Nice! I totally got lucky with that one. I didn't even see it. But an infusion is really helpful. So, we'll run up here, maybe try to get another item out of this. Nice. Smart shopper. Enemies drop extra gold. That's really helpful. And can we get something out of this? Yes, we can. I don't like that. 
I believe, well, actually, I can't really remember what it does, but I remember not liking it. So we'll turn the rest of this money into experience, and we'll be on our way with that. Bye-bye. The Hive Cluster. Now, this is not a bad level. I personally don't think the enemies here are bad. Uh, here are tough at all. I think they're actually very easy, and when you're down here, it's even easier because uh, they really can't get to you. So, that guy's just going to be forced to sit there as I wail on him. Yeah. Um, seriously. Like, I'm, 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 I'm not kidding when I say that. I mean, it's taking, him, taking us a while because he's an elite guy, but he's dying. And my dog is barking. Oh, I should end this video. It's getting a little long. I'll see you. I'll see you back in a second.